Okay, good evening everyone and welcome to the final of the Esports Heaven One Night Wonder Cup with me, Techman Zinian, and also with H2K TV Eagle. And uh, the final is going to be between Oxmos and Sea Orcs. You've made it quite comfortably to the final of this cup. And uh the quick roster rundown while they're going to go into the knife run. For Oxmas we have Frenchy, Oswald, Art, Juxy, Niagen, and for Sea Orgs we got Odo, Kozji, Froster, Toxji and Disco Dan. Remember this is a mixed team for Sea Orgs with Par or with Froster and Toxji plan for Par Gaming and Disco Dances sparking from them. And uh Sea Orgs pick up the knife run. Let's uh see what side they're gonna go here. And the defence on City Street. This again is quite a one-sided map on the fence, but over time it's it's gotten a bit of both. Same with every map really now. So they're uh, taking the classic choice, as it were. Yeah, and I see. I prefer to go attacking first, so I know what I have to do in the fence. But anyway. I'm going to run up. And we're going to get quickly underway. See, so you're asking uh, Oxmo's uh, what they're going to do, tactic wise. Yeah. Some pre -match they're not giving butter. anything away. Do you, uh, are you up to date on the prizes of this cup? No, there's no prizes for this cup. Um, the said, it's just about taking my own time just to host a cup for just to see what oh. the community want in terms of maps and give the map makers feedback on each map. Um, so far, Danaman seems to be the community seem to like it a lot, except there's a good some things which need to be improved, but it's definitely getting there. And that's the point of this cup, just to test out the new maps, etc. It's good to see some good teams involved. Hopefully we do more of them in the future, just after Christmas. I'll be taking a big break after Christmas. Yep, and the first round is on the way. Oh no, of course. Whoa, what's that? Discord has falling to his death. I'm not sure where that happened, because uh, I only know the, the bottomless pit, or uh, the water pit, or whatever it is. As, um... Wow, I'm completely uh, lost my game here. As the bomb is being brought on to A for uh, for Oxmo's on the attack, and it's going down. Yes, it's planted. Only two players for Sea Orcs to uh, to undo this plant. Now one, cause you cause you one on three being fired upon. Gets the one, one that wasn't watching. Oh, and gets taken out as he tries to back down. From uh, from that building, first round a great goes to Oxmos. Start. A great start by Oxmos. Um, I think Disco Dance got tagged through the wall, and then once he jumped down the stairs, he fell to his death, and he didn't get hit this time. Wow! Early needs are thrown out. Yeah, it did. Early needs are thrown out, but no one finds anyone, so it's five on five here straight off the bat. Looks to me like Os Oxmos are gonna have two here to swing around mid. Are they gonna push it or just take it slow? See, it's a split attack here with one going down the mid. Oswald takes a disco dance and Art falls up on Ono. That's quickly down to 3 on 5 and all the pressure has gone on the Sea Orgs now. Left for Sea Orgs, we have Cosgy, Froster and Tox. Let's see what they can do here after a pressed performance by Toxy last map. Let's see where they can fold up and Cosgy shuts down Art. And relieves some of the pressure on the Sea Orgs team and then shuts down Juxi. It's a great play there by Cosgy with a double frag with the egg. And it's 3 on 3 here. And Oxmos are definitely going to slow it down here and try and get a pick. Oswald's got the bomb in hand and does pick up a frag on Foster. Sprays back A, doesn't find anyone. And uh, let's see, I think we're going to rotate to B here. As the B bomb site is now clear. And he is, Oswald's going to plant B. And it's going to be tough here for Sea Orgs, especially since they're both at A site. Cosy's got the deagle on hand. 
Explosives planted. Push through mid. The bomb is now down, so Seahawks have it all to do here with Toxie and Cos. Najin shuts down Toxie and then Cosy takes down Najin's one on two. What could Cosy do here? Smoke goes out. It's made a lot of noise and it's gonna get shut down here by Oxmos. If he doesn't, I'll be quite surprised. Yeah, he's rushed into B bomb sizes in the open and then Oswald takes him down. And that's a great start by Oxmos and it's 2 0. And they are on the attacking side. Yep. Let's, uh, let's keep it on Oxmo. I see uh, Juski is the probably the fastest player currently playing. Going for A. With the. Uh, oh, he's got an M4. Really? Really? The people still playing with those guns. I'm all for uh, creative gun use, because it's been uh, mostly AK's, uh, 74U's, and uh, the snipers. Yeah. M4 is a good so gun too. Uh, it's used a lot at the start of COD 4, but times have changed. And the AK is more of the preferred weapon. Oh, I think it's an M4. And yeah, it's an, I already said that. It's not an M16, because they look alike a lot. The one's burst. So, uh, Juski's gonna get, be into a world of trouble here. Is he gonna. Is he was going to get attacked from behind. But, uh, did not have to come to that. As, uh,. Someone took him out from front as well, and Takshu does the same to someone else. Two to one. Seawrugs making a slight comeback. Yeah, well, it's got a long way to go here. <laughs> they need a good lot of runs, as attacking is difficult. There's only three main routes you can really go. And uh, Ono opens up a fragging on Juxty with a nice scope shot there. Let's stay with Ono in the meantime and see what else he can do with the scope. Finds 1A, it doesn't get the frag. Froster shuts down Oswald, Najin replies on Froster with an AK. 3 on 4 in favour of Power Gaming, and Frenchy shuts down Ono with a scope. But then Ono got the nade out and takes down Najin. That is the end of Ono with a scope. And uh, Frenchy has all to do here as Cosgy shut down Art, and Disco Dance then follows up on Frenchy and it's 2 all. There's a good round there by Seorgs and called a timeout, I wonder why. Looks like Cos is lagging a wee bit. Ah, a technical yeah, timeout. Lagging. Is Either there a limit on timeouts? No, you're one each half. Someone, um... Yeah, Cos is lagging, so that must be downloading Gay Prawn. <laughs> okay, hmm. Huh? Well, let's uh, take this opportunity to remind everyone that uh, our stream is completely powered by i3D, Interactive 3D, and uh, I'm thinking, yeah, this server we're playing on is actually from i3D, Power Gaming. Thank you for uh, yeah. using that. And uh, if you're looking for a game server, voice server, dedicated server, any kind of server that you can imagine, check out i3D.net, because they got basically anything you want. And they're one of the best in Europe, and they also support us. So check them out if you're in the market for a server. Oh, we need to ready up. Ah, uh, it's uh, totally never sounds right. Yeah, Froster, Crimey River. <laughs> yeah, Toxty knows what he's talking about. As uh, we are in another round, and Art tosses a nade exactly on Froster. And uh, we're going to follow Oswald. From Oxmos, who's in a nice forward position. Oh, gets taken out by Toxture. That, uh, that offensive run ended right there. Juxi, on the other hand, getting the bomb down. And uh, it's looking pretty good for Oxmos, I'd say. Bombs down. Oh, there goes one of the opponents. Toxture left and standing. One on two. Skip over to Toxture, see if he can do this. 
Oh no, he can't. Gets taken out as soon as he comes around the corner. Three to two in favor of Oxmos. As we head into another round, let's follow Jukski, who picked up the bomb and also threw out some interesting looking nades. However, they caught no one. Now in the middle of some smoke. Can't really do much. Moving forward towards that B site. Going, deciding to go in the downstairs. Oh, Disco Dance catches a nade. nade. As the ox mode is uh, sort of surrounding one of the CRS players. Uh, I think they heard him now. Still on Jukski. In the middle of the action here. Go for the plant. Not faking it, going all the way. Oh, yeah, he's got it. Last man standing, Kasha, in the middle of that. Oh, Kasha, taken out from Naidan, who was uh, still in the middle of the map with some good positioning. And that makes it 4 to 2 in favor of Oxmos. The uh, French team slowly increasing their lead. Let's check out Disco Dance, who appears to be uh, dying quite fast uh, lately. With uh, three kills, three deaths in that market. Not seeing anyone. Oh, gets taken out through uh, through some sort of rafters, where Sears uh, takes uh, some good use of. And then it's all over, three to zero. Uh, I mean five to two, of course. Oxmos increasing the lead with one more point. Let's check out who their uh, sniper was. It's got to be Ono. Ono for uh, for Seahorse. Oh, Ono apparently does not snipe this round. He's uh, taking an AK. Hop into that middle. We'll be, we'll be meeting someone here. Oh, does not get it. That goes down into a firefight with Frenchy. Two on two. Let's stick with Frenchy. As, uh... People on a killing spree often go for more, but uh, while Frenchy's here is uh, is uh, rotating to A, his teammates get taken out, and it's a one on two. Picks up that uh, sniper rifle as a secondary. Throws a nade to B, looking good. Oh, it's a special, unlucky, or I'm not sure what that sounded like. Clears the first house. We'll be meeting Froster. Oh, Froster got a very sneaky position. Takes him out with much ease. Making it 5-3. Let's uh, go to the other side. Who's got the scopes on Oxmo's? Whoa. Oh, there we go. Oxmo's friend, she's got the scope. And oh, you get taken out by Ono as Ono finally does decide to uh, snipe. And, uh, wow, fast round here. Players dropping left and right, mostly from Oxmos, Oswald and Naden uh, left. Oswald in the middle of the site, market area. Last man standing now. Regens, three opponents remaining. He's got one opponent on A, but he doesn't know that. And two on B. Decides to go for A. Turns out to be some more choice. Can he get this? All the players backing down. Sea Yorks player backing down. He doesn't have the bomb though, so... Probably uh, going to play this for the team deathmatch. Finds one. Shoots him under the car. Nice, accurate little shots. Taking him out. We'll be meeting with another one. Oh, gets the second one. Froster and Oswald one on one. Froster with that uh, AKU. And Oswald with the uh, regular AK. However... Froster's got time on his hands, 30 seconds to be exact, and Oswald needs to go get that bomb or kill his opponent. They're uh, pretty far apart, but Oswald decides to uh, go for the bomb. It's just good to have. And then runs into B. And doesn't look very cautiously. I think uh, he knows that Froster's on A. Gets the plant, obviously. One on one. It's going to be hard for Froster. Froster in that market, Oswald in the side hall, sort of above market. I'd say uh, this, he's got a better position here. 
However, Oswald thinks his opponent will be coming from the right, while uh, Froster is down below. But these players obviously know the map good enough to uh, know every route, as Oswald doesn't leave the bomb site for an instant, as he wants to hear if that defuse is going on. 12 seconds. Froster has to do it now. Oh, starts making noise, starts spamming the most obvious place, and goes for the defuse. Probably times it perfect, but will Oswald peek him? Yes, he will! Takes him out 6-3. to three. Oswald, very smart play there. Calculated to the second. I expect nothing less from such experienced players such as Oswald. And by the way, sorry I pinged that. Uh, let's keep it with Oswald actually. Let's see where given the momentum from that one on one bidding Froster there. And he gets tied up in mid, but does not get fragged, and Art comes to help him and shuts down Ono with a nice headshot there. He takes a lot of fire and calls his shuts him down. Trixie then replies and calls Jane that's four and three situation in favour of Oxmos now. And Parr then you know, takes a little bit of pressure off themselves and shuts down Nige and, and Oswald replies on Froster. A lot of frags have been quickly exchanged here. Oswald goes for the frag at back back end his last bullet, manages to find Disco Dump. He's all off the Toxy now, he gets tied up with a deagle by Oswald. Froster's taking a lot of damage and the bomb is now down by Juxi and this will be a uh, Oxmos run. Oh, but uh, Toxic has a lifeline and takes down Oswald with a deagle. He does have time to reload that AK. But then, uh, doesn't really make it far and gets shut down by Juxi by that nice, nice brand new M4. It's currently 7 3 in favour of Oxmos and. I think that's the problem really, that CEOs aren't actually, it's just a mixed team at the minute. Uh, with Froster and Topsy and Disco Dance playing, whereas Oxmos are more of a team. They've been around for a while now, and maybe that's why they're dominating them so badly. Nita now being the last man standing for Oxmos. Not looking too good with three opponents left and not carrying the bomb. However, he sort of cleared the B site. Spamming some. Oh, gets it. I didn't even see that uh, hit counter. I think he's uh, definitely frag hunting here. Taking the opposite route of the route to the bomb. Oh, gets another one. Nice. One on one. He's got all chances. Oh, Taksha pushing here slower. Oh, he's ducked. He's, he's sneaking. Nijden could get into some trouble around this corner here. Oh, yes, he does. And Taksha has got a nice kill on his name. 7 to 4. Seals will definitely be looking around to pick up this last run. And try and have a lifeline for them. And French opens perfect start to the round for Oxmos. So he shuts down Froster, but then Disco Dance launches attack to defend Stukes. And it's quickly a 4 on 4 with Disco Dance tagging Nige and with that M4. And now it's. Oxmos have it all the day here. 3 on 4. CEOs are just definitely looking around to crowd out each bomb site. Maybe have one mid, one A, and two B. That's exactly what they have actually. It looks like they're going to rotate to the B bomb site here. The bomb carrier is sitting in mid. And lots of fire exchange, but no one gets a frag, only tag. Art is going to pick up a, maybe two frags here, shuts down Ono. Oh is he going to pick up a second frag? No, he doesn't. Just because she, because she shuts down Oswald. That's two on three in favour of Sea Orgs. Because he gets shut down by French, and it's two on two. Mm, this is a very important round for Sea Orgs and top. Toxie finds a frag on French, and Art shuts down Disco Dance. It's a one on one here, can't Toxie? Win another one on one here. The bomb is now down, so the advantage has shifted towards Art. This would be a great round for Oxmos if they could get it. Art is not moving behind that car and gets tied up by Toxie, and Toxie Jaws find the frag on Art with the AK. And he's going to go in for a simple defuse, and the score is going to be 7 5 going into half time. That was a lifeline that Seox just needed. Explosives diffused. been a pretty good game. The whole tournament's been quite good actually. A lot of even matches, <laughs> especially against the top teams. 
been no real upset, so it's been good. One of you guys. <laughs> yeah, I was right. I'm not that stupid. I know how to read it. As we wait for Frost, here, there he goes into the second half. Where uh, is my uh, GUI a bit messed up? It's seven to five to Oxmos, right? Yep, seven five to Oxmos. Yeah, first round mess up, obviously. As uh, Oxmos take the first kill. And uh, we're gonna look at Frenchie. Frenchie's got the scope. I didn't know uh, he had. He's uh, I, uh, not my favorite kind of shooting. Just spamming into some clouds, but doesn't connect either. Seems uh, oh Frenchie now with a nice quick show on scope on Takja. Gets uh, opposing fire, however, from Ono, oh and gets taken out, and ma that makes it zero to two players. 5-8. Hmm. Well, currently top fragging is Oswald. And because he is lagging again with 500 ping, but he is top fragging for Seorg. And uh, let's stick with Oswald. Let's see what he can do here. Since he is currently top fragging, he does have a SMG in hand, spams middle, and how did he not find that frag on Froster? It's beyond me. Should have really taken him down there. But anyway, Toasty gets shut down and it's 4 on 5. And a lot of double frag there by Art with the SMG towards the A bomb site. And Seos have it all to do here with Oswald finding a headshot and Disco dances up to cause so he cannot do anything. So he doesn't have a chance as Gypsy takes him out with the AK. And uh, Oxmos are rolling here. Oh. Let's check out Disco Dance for uh, Oxmos. Uh, for Seorgs, of course, with that scope, he's, uh, he's covering his teammates for bringing the bomb towards A. And, well, it looks like, oh, Oxmo's player is running in left and right, but taken, taken out as well. Naiden being last man standing, move over to Naiden. Oxmo's Naiden has got a hard task up for him. Four players, no, it's not going to work. It actually takes him out through one of the windows. Six to nine. Seorgs mm. picks up a round. Still a lot of the Seahawks have a lot to do here. Oxmos are still rolling. A disco dance again gets an open frag on Oswald. They will need to stop that. Oxmos are wanting to win this championship. Well, a championship cup. One night to wonder Esports Heaven Cup. World Esports Ever Global Grand Final Master League. <laughs> You should just always play your best, and I think these players do. Yeah, man. Everyone wants to win, and anyone who doesn't want to win shouldn't be playing. It's as simple as that. Definitely. Two players left remaining for Oxmos. as uh, Art and Taxtu. Let's check out Art. No, let's move over to Taxtu. <laughs> this has got a way more interesting position. Oh, and it's over. I was uh, looking at the wrong person. Oxmos players dropping another round for C Orgs seven to nine. They could be uh, could be starting some good comebacks here, as they need a lot more rounds to be getting on the level of Oxmos. First car kill from Frenchie onto Kosje. Oh, I just I want to see those kills. So <laughs> always looks so good. Four on three. Oxmo's slightly at disadvantage. Let's check out Dukeski. Who is... No, that's not, because uh, all the enemies are running away from him. Naden is in the middle of it. And we'll be meeting three players very soon. Here comes one. Oh, goes directly for the kill, and his teammates take him out for that. Should have waited perhaps a bit longer if he knew. Dukeski 
takes out Takshi with a very easy pick. Will uh, be last man standing. And will be facing two Seahawks players very soon. One on the right, one on the left. Does not sp and now he spots him. Gets the kill. One on one. Disco Dance versus Juxi. Juxi at a heavy disadvantage for time and health. Health regenerates, however. And oh, gets it. Nice on Disco Dance. Maybe he shouldn't have jumped, but uh, nice killing here for uh, for Juxi and gets the defuse. Obviously, ten to seven. Oxmo's take another round and uh, move forward to that thirteen. Yeah. Um. And seven in favor of Oxus. Disco Dance there gets taken out, but then Frost opens the fragment of art and also the replies on Disco Dance. He does eventually get taken out. It's quickly gone into a 4 on 4 here, and Juxi ties up Froster and shuts him down. Nadge and then takes out Cause J. Oh, a lot of frags being exchanged quickly here. Has left the last man standing, talks to you, but he does reply on Oswald. Gives away his position as well. Gets one. Yeah, gets Niagen. Get two more. Oh, gets a second. Oh. That's a one on one here for Toxty against Frenchie. Frenchie's got the scope and Toxty's got the AK. Toxty then has picked up the bomb and needs it back, eh? It looks like they're running the further and further away from each other here. Toxty, if Toxty know what Frenchie was seeing, he would have yeah, run for A. Yeah, a lot of... Uh, Frenchy can't really do a lot here, there's two options. Either go down B site and through mid, or back. Back towards oh. their spawn, and he does up for the middle position. Toxie, you see him here, and it's great. Nice. One on four cuts there by Toxie, and that's why he is one of the best players in power gaming. And power gaming are going to be Tuxie, a good team. Uh, peaking just a little second too early there, or else he would have seen him coming through the gates. But this is good too. For his sake. <laughs> Frenchie on low health. Let's check out where Frenchie is in the middle of... Oh, he's sniping quite uh, aggressively. Let's see if he finds anyone. Probably won't, as all the action is at the A site, where Jukski is overlooking it with his M4. I'm still uh, somewhat... What's the word? <laughs> somewhat uh, surprised by the M4. Oh, goes down. Kostya with the bomb, and oh, the last man standing, being surrounded from all sides. Survives one, no, no, doesn't survive the second one. 8 to 11, Oxmos are nearing in for that 12 and 13 rounds win. Jukski and a lot of his teammates with the opening frag, well, frag nades, I should say. Got some picks. No kill, there is the first kill. Oswald takes out Kostya. Oh, and Disco Dance replies on Jukski, who was uh, filling around with that B, uh, A fence. As Seerx is getting the bomb down on A. Disco Dance knows he's going to pick up one. Yes, he does. Oh, but Oxmo's denies the, uh, the planter. Making it 12 to 8, last round, could be the last round. Match point, and uh, I think championship point, or cup point, I should say, for Oxmos. Oh, oh, with some heavy wall banging. Huge oh. nin by Fred. Oswald then follows up on Ono, but gets shut down by Toxji. And what can the Dutch duo of Power Gaming do here? Can they save their team? And I see their team oh, here, they're they can't cross, they get shut down, and then Art takes out Toxed. And that is a good game for Oxmos. It and sure Oxmos is. Win is the Esports having one night wonder. Congratulations to the French team. And with that match, I uh, think that concludes our night of streaming. If you are interested and you want to see more, check out h2ktv.com. We've got uh, over 100 videos on the man since uh, yesterday, actually. So if you want to check them all out and be on the level that we are with the <laughs> history of seeing matches, then uh, 
you should find a lot and not a content there. And if you don't want to watch the VODs, we'll just see you next time and when we're live on h2ktv.com. Thank you for watching.